Hi everyone, it's Video Friday. Welcome back to Photography by Harrison. And we're continuing our comparison test between the FC2500 and the FC300. And with that said, I will see you on the other side. This is my third and final test comparing the FC2500 with the FC300. Why you ask? Because the FC2500 was a rental and it had to go back. I was standing at the same location when I took these two pictures, but as you can see, there's a bigger crop on the FC2500. When you zoom in on these two pictures, which one has less noise and better detail? Again, which camera has less noise and shows more detail in the brick when you zoom in? How well can you read the street sign and the restaurant sign? Which camera do you prefer? Again, when you zoom in, which camera has less noise and more detail in the bricks? In this picture, when you zoom in into the street sign, which one can you read better? Which one has less noise and more detail? And finally, when you zoom in into the W from across the street, which camera would you prefer? Well, what do you think about my comparison test? The FC300 or the FC2500? Which one you think has shown the best? And if you're watching this on YouTube, Leave, leave your answer, your comment below. And also, if you're watching this on Facebook, leave a comment. And as always, if you like what you see, give me a thumbs up, thumbs up so I know what I'm doing right. If you don't like what you see, you, it's all right to give me a thumbs down. Just leave a comment so I know what I'm not doing right to work on. Because when people give you a thumbs up, they give, that motivates you to work on what you're not doing right. So the next time when you watch one of my videos, you too, to give me a thumbs down might give me a thumbs up. 
But like I said before, no one knows it all when it comes to photography. And of course, the more we learn about photography, the more we learn we didn't know. And I will see you next time.